a year when restaurants all across the valley step up to raise money for Three Square Food Bank. Joining me tonight is Las Vegas Weekly reporter Leslie Ventura, dishing on all the different restaurants taking part and how this helps those in need. Uh, thanks for being with us. Let's get right into it for new Las Vegas right. who maybe aren't familiar. Uh, what is Restaurant Week? And talk a little bit about the food insecurity issue in Las Vegas. Totally. Restaurant Week is a charitable effort where restaurants throughout Las Vegas uh, pair up with Three Square Food Bank, a nonprofit in town. And um, they create a special menu so people can come on in, try a you know discounted menu, and a portion of those proceeds go back to Three Square Food Bank and help um, those people in need, the people, the hungry folks who um, there are 13 percent of CC um, of Clark County are what we consider food insecure. So it's a big help. It's such a genius idea because you're allowing people to explore new restaurants and kind of new cuisine, but mm -hmm. also, as you pointed out, giving back, and it is such a need. Some of the restaurants involved this year that really uh, we want to highlight, what are some that are on the top of the list? Um, Ariel is one of the top. It's the one on our cover, and they have a short rib ravioli that is to die for, Ooh. so definitely there. Sparrow and Wolf is a local one that's participating. Again, a really popular restaurant, and my personal favorite is Rivea at Delano. Really, really beautiful um, location, kind of romantic. So, um, you know, whichever one suits your flavor. Since it's your personal favorite, what do you go to as your go to dish there? The lobster, I'm sorry, yeah, the lobster risotto is absolutely fantastic and it's on the menu. So, you know, you can try that, try a few other things, and you're giving back to charity. Dinner break's coming up. I don't know whether to go short rib ravioli or the lobster risotto. They both sound absolutely they, tremendous. They both sound awesome. What is your other than the giving back? Back, which is such a beautiful part of it. What's mm -hmm. your favorite part? Um, honestly, my favorite part is getting to try restaurants that you might not normally get to try. I mean, we all live in this dining capital, but um, not everything is affordable or accessible. So this makes it so you can try pretty much any restaurant you've wanted to. That's a great point. People from all over the world come here. One of the reasons is to eat this incredible cuisine up mm -hmm. and down the strip, and we get to go out and do it for a good cause. Also, Robert Irvin's public house at Tropicana. What's going on there Monday? Yeah, uh, it's actually going on today. Today. Oh, yeah, today. Um, yeah, probably in like an hour or 30 minutes. <laughs> Let's uh, go. Yeah, they're kicking off Restaurant Week today, but Restaurant Week technically kicks off Monday, so it's a little confusing, but that event's going off, off tonight. It's a cookout, um, should be really fun, drinks, food, and then Monday is when the week actually kicks off. You can visit Restaurant Week's website and check out all the menus, or of course, pick up pick up a Las Vegas Weekly, check out our recommendations, and then all you got to do is call and make a reservation and show up. You've made it nice and easy. <laughs> is he the one that's the amazing chef and he's also like super ripped? Yes. Yeah, that guy. He is swole. He's, he's what the kids call swole. <laughs> <laughs> cooks half the day and then lifts weights the other half exactly, of the day. Yeah. Well, thank you for being thank here. You. Great information. You can read more about Restaurant Weeks in this week's edition of Las Vegas Weekly and Culture, both on newsstands right now. Thanks, Leslie. We'll go over now and check in with Ted and Christy.